We're joined by Charles Ferguson, the director and creator of Inside Job, an extraordinary and hard-hitting film on the crisis that erupted in 2007 and the 20 years prior that led to the crisis and the consequences for our society, our politics, and our economy going forward. Charles, thank you for being here today. Thank you for having me. I've been speaking at schools like Williams and Amherst and Swarthmore and Cal Berkeley. I think the question of university ethics and individual ethics among professors is a very important dimension and uh, had played a much more significant role in the crisis. Though I remember your, your line was that the financial services industry had an influence that most American people didn't understand. But you used very strong words. You said they had corrupted the study of economics itself. How, how does it manifest? I think the corruption has been very real and I think it's been directly financial. I, there, of course there are other factors that operate in economics. People have political views, they have ideologies, they have intellectual beliefs, you know. And, and, and those things also can influence who gets hired and whose articles get accepted and so on. So you, of course there are other things going on too, but at least in, in this domain, in the question of the regulation of large important industries, especially financial services, not just financial services, I've seen similar issues in telecommunications and energy, for example. But uh, financial services is the largest, most important and worst offender in this regard, there's, there's no question in my mind that, that very directly financial uh, issues have played a major role. And, and they've played a role both directly in the sense that you know, professors take large amounts of money and, and then act in support of this industry. Um, but there's also a very powerful indirect effect. You know, if you're getting a PhD and your thesis advisor is one of these people, then you know, you're going to be pretty careful about what you say and what you write about. And similarly, if you're submitting articles to journals where these people are, are on the editorial board of the journal, uh, and they're going to be the ones hiring you if you're trying to get a job in economics. Um, so you know, I, I think that, that there has come to be a, a very pervasive and, and I, you know, I have to say a, a very sinister kind of effect um, that's, that's really not that different from the revolving door and the things that you know, we more conventionally associate with this problem. If you look at who's on the Board of Trustees, the Board of Overseers of Harvard, the Board of Trustees of Columbia, you know, these, uh, the Board of Regents of the University of California, you see a lot of financiers, first of all. And, uh, and then secondly, as you point out, their overwhelming goal is fundraising. And who do you fundraise from? You fundraise from the wealthy. Uh, and uh, these days the wealthy are very heavily in finance.